Hi Whovians, Harry here and the 14th Doctor's sonic screwdriver has just been revealed and this is amazing. As before, we have only seen new shots and leaked footage of this new sonic screwdriver and we've never seen it in um, high definition. We've never seen a good look at this new sonic screwdriver. However, Doctor Who has just recently tweeted out and also released a video on this new sonic screwdriver and that is what this video is going to go over today. But before we get into the video, don't forget to subscribe, also leave a like and comment down below and let's get in to the video. So first I will play this um, little video that Doctor Who released on the new sonic screwdriver and then I will go over the design of this new sonic. Do we get a look at it? It just pans along. It looks very cool and I like this kind of mysterious vibe they're giving to uh, this Sonic. Fits with the mysterious nature of David Tennant coming back as the Doctor. Yeah. It's cool indeed. Rotating edge. And like these weird claw things. Oh, it just looks so cool, really. And then we get a look inside it, which is amazing. I mean, look at all the gears and, like, it's very gallifrey -ian. Well, of course it is. It's sonic. And then we get a good look at it. And that is everything. So that's just amazing. I mean, we got... Um, it was very mysterious, very cool. It's just looked amazing and I will go over some of the things that we saw on the sonic screwdriver. So this new version of the sonic screwdriver is described as the 14th Doctor sonic screwdriver so that looks like it will only be for David Tennant's version of the Doctor and Shuti Gatwa will get a new sonic screwdriver and I expect that will be um, revealed after the 60th anniversary specials but this sonic screwdriver of course has a lot of references to um, the ninth all the way through to the 13th Doctor and this makes a lot of sense because David Tennant's face has come back from the 10th Doctor so there's going to be a lot of examples of New Who in the 60th anniversary special and the screwdriver is basically this in a physical form. So the 14th Doctor sonic screwdriver has the same cracked porcelain texture as the 9th and 10th Doctor sonic screwdriver um, they both have this, like, well, cracked porcelain texture, which just looks so cool. And also, the emitter on this Sonic is blue, like the 9th and 10th Doctor's um, Sonic when they're emitter. So that is just so cool, too. And another reference to the 9th and 10th Doctor's Sonic is that this Sonic also has a metal slider. And if you don't know what... Um, this slider is. It is a part of the Sonic used to reveal the tube where the Doctor, of course, reads the data that the Sonic provides um, for him once he's scanned a bit of technology to um, read what what um, that data is about. And of course, it's a lot of references to the 9th and 10th Doctor, as of course David Tennant played the 10th Doctor. However, you've got to remember that this is the 14th Doctor and not the 10th Doctor. He has also been, since the 10th Doctor, he has been the 11th, 12th and 13th Doctor as well, before landing in this 14th incarnation. And, and that is why this sonic screwdriver also has references to the 11th, 12th and 13th Sonics. So, the 14th Doctor's new Sonic has extendable claws, like the 11th and 12th Doctor's Sonic. Um, and the claws are a little bit different, but I will go into that later. But as well as having similarities in the claw, both have similar copper plating in similar places um, on the Sonics. And also the 14th Doctor Sonic has a similar um, like black matte uh, texture um, that the 11th and 12th Doctor Sonic had as well. So those similarities are very similar to the 11th and 12th Doctor Sonic. However, I didn't find any similarities to the 12th Doctor's second Sonic or his Sonic sunglasses. So we'll just uh, move past that for the time being. So I didn't find any references to them. However, I did find a reference to 13th Doctor's Sonic because the um, 14th Doctor's Sonic through 
screwdriver the tube that the claws and the metal holding the emitter on looks like stainless steel which is what the 13th Doctor's Sonic was made out of. The 13th Doctor has stated a couple of times that her Sonic was made out of steel and this is what this um, Sonic looks like it has been made out of well stainless steel as well as the 13th Doctor's Sonic. And now new parts of the Sonic screwdriver that I don't think are references to past Sonic screwdrivers. The bottom rotates similar to how the time rotor in the TARDIS rotates, the time rotor there, the bottom of the screwdriver rotates in a similar way. And the claws extend in a different way to the 11th and 12th Doctor Sonic, as well as the this new Sonic having lights on the tips of the claws. So it's just a bit different to the 11th and 12th Doctor Sonic. And also the slider that is a reference to the 9th and 10th Doctor Sonic screwdriver might have a Gallifreyan symbol on it and also it seems to be made out of metal which is different to 9 and 10's um, Sonic screwdriver. And then before we get a full look at the Sonic screwdriver in the um, video I just showed you, we um, get to see inside the Sonic and we pass a lot of gears and moving parts and just before we get to this blue light we pass by um, what looks to be Gallifreyan symbols. I don't know what this could mean and I don't know why they're inside the Sonic, but maybe this could have something to do with the slider if the slider um, does have a Gallifreyan symbol on it, like I suspect. And then we move through this blue light and this probably creates the blue light that we see emitting from the Sonic. But I just think this Sonic is amazing. It's so mysterious how they announced it. I think it has been on pre-sale um, since this was announced, which was a, a couple of days ago. I think pre-sale has already sold out, um, but I'm sure that they'll be um, making more and they will be restocked again soon. So, uh, well, congratulations maybe if you got your hands on the Sonic, but if you haven't, I am sure they will be uh, making more and this Sonic just looks amazing. But let me know down in the comments below what you think of this Sonic. And also, if you like this video, don't forget to leave a like. Also subscribe and share it out. And we'll see you in the next one.